The Republican candidate for the White House, Donald Trump, is facing fresh criticism tonight for his comments about the Muslim parents of an American soldier. The French president, Francois Hollande, said Mr. Trump's words made him want to retch. The candidate has also been attacked by Barack Obama as a Republican congressman claims he'll be voting for Hillary Clinton. Here's our North America editor, John Sopel. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the next president of the United States, Mr. Donald J. Trump. The music is all right now, but things have been very far from all right these past few days for Donald Trump after his damaging spat with the parents of a Muslim U.S. Army captain killed in Iraq and decorated for his bravery. But today Mr. Trump was able to brandish a gallantry medal of his own, though it had been given to him by a vet who'd been injured in conflict. I always wanted to get the Purple Heart. This was much easier. But Mr. Trump would have never won a Purple Heart because as the New York Times documents today, on five occasions, he managed to avoid being drafted to fight in the Vietnam War. Unease on the Republican side has resulted in the first congressman jumping ship. Richard Hanna from New York said, he's unfit to serve our party and cannot lead this country. While I disagree with her on many issues, I will vote for Mrs. Clinton. And today at the White House, the president piled in. I think the Republican nominee is unfit uh, to serve as president. Uh, I said so last week, and uh, he keeps on proving it. The fact that he doesn't appear to have basic knowledge around uh, critical issues in Europe, in the Middle East, in Asia, uh, means that he's woefully unprepared uh, to do this job. And now another president has intervened, this time the French president. Though French may be the language of diplomacy, there is nothing nuanced about Francois Hollande's intervention. He said Donald Trump's most recent comments made him want to retch. They were sickening, he said. In the race for the White House, Donald Trump has discovered there is such a thing as political gravity after all. Since the conventions, there have been a slew of polls, and whilst they must have the usual health warnings, they all point in the same direction, that his support has gone down and Hillary Clinton's has gone up. John Sopel, BBC News, Washington.